Hi, hopefuls. Thanks so much for coming back to my channel today. I hope you guys are doing great. Is it, If this is the first time that you have clicked on um, my channel or this video, um, hello, my name is Hope. And um, this is a grocery haul, Dollar Tree haul, and fill in the gaps prepping haul. So I went down this rabbit hole of prepping for my family and mainly for um, the winter if we don't can't get out. Um, also, I am really enjoying already having stuff on hand. So, now I have a short list of stuff to get. And, um, this is filling in the gaps if and replenishing what we have may have used. So, anyway, welcome. I do all different types of videos, mainly grocery hauls right now. <laughs> but, um, just feel free to look around and welcome to the channel. Okay, y'all. So, um, the other day I did a video on some things I ordered from Sam's.com and I did read, I should have screenshot, I may, I may find it and screenshot the, um, comment and she said to make smaller orders and I figured it out on my own. It's best to make small orders so they won't put one, a whole bunch of stuff in one big order at Sam's.com. So I'm loving Sam's.com though because with the premium membership because I don't have to pay for shipping. And so anyway, these were the last two things that came, the Mrs. Buttersworth syrup. I think y'all, this is like $6 and something for both of these big things of syrup. This is a 64 ounce. And this, I already have one of these and a big one. This was about, I think $5 and some change. So we are good on hash browns and a lot of you have told me numerous of you guys have told me that those are really good so that'll be great to have and that they're even better than the frozen i got some leggings and we saw these leggings the other day um and i waited and i shouldn't have waited because just about all of my size is gone and but they have lots of real small like zero x and five x i think four x maybe so, my size, like, 1X and 2X were gone. So, um, yeah. I was in, they're 1167, and I was in a 1X, but it's just more comfortable. And I probably can't wear a 1X, but it's more comfortable to wear these. But, sis need to get it together. Okay. Regardless if the holidays is coming. Okay, so, on my short list, y'all, is lasagna noodles. I did not have any lasagna noodles. I was watching someone and I was like, oh, I haven't got any because I like to make lasagna rolls sometimes. And anyway, y'all, they only had two. And the um, associate said that they just put it out last night. So these are like 116 and the oven ready is 168 or was it 170? 168. So only got one of those. So next time I go on Walmart, which there was a couple of things I was making a mental note. And going back through my list again, I did take my list with me. I'll get two more of the lasagna and we should be good because I don't make it all the time. And then this is $2. I think I was watching someone's haul and this is a four pack of the one pound packages. So it's $2 for those. I know in our house, we have spaghetti just about every week or every other week. So that's why I went ahead and picked that up, even though I have some from Sam's and I got some for like four cents at Harris Teeter. Yeah, and I think Wayman's one time. Okay, y'all, so I like these seasoned Italian green beans. These are like $1.24. Um, so I only picked up two of those. And the other day, they did not have any whipping cream. So I wanted to get this and put it in the freezer for the holidays. I got two other cheddar cheese um, for mac and cheese. So I only got two of these. I think... Um, this was kind of pricey. It was like a dollar and something, y'all, for these. And then I got two more of the cream of celery. They are like 76 cents, which is a lot. I don't know why. Why so much more than the cream of mushroom and cream of chicken? I got two of the premium sausage. I like these because you can just throw them in the freezer, tuck them somewhere. And we had one last night, and I just want to make sure we have some enough for Christmas. I got some ground beef, and we're either going to have them taco salad tonight or either chili beans tonight i got two things of no four things of bread the other bread is over there 
they haven't been eating a lot of bread, but they just started back. <laughs> so I had to dig for some bread in the freezer. I found some, but um, there are four things that I plan on doing this winter. So if like we really can't go out or even if, no, we probably can't go out, but it's just four things are my goals for this winter. And I guess fall, learn how to can, learn how to garden. I want to get some books, watch some videos. Um, I'm trying to think what else I wanted to learn. I don't want to can, garden, <sighs> practice some more with dehydration. And I know, I don't know if it's going to be a shortage or not, but I just like now have a stuff on hand, but there probably will be some shortages. But even if it's not, I mean, well, even if it's a shortage like on jars and stuff, I just still want to learn the process of canning, um, period. So I had to put that on pause, even though I have all my equipment, but put that on pause because of my stove and they never, my, what I get, it was Lowe's. I never was able to get a stove. So I'm just gonna have to find somebody else. And I just canceled that order because they kept pushing the date back. And I need that big eye to can. So I wish I got a gas, gas stove in this house. But anyway. Anyway, y'all, I got some honey corn muffin mix. I've seen several people haul this. It's 67 cents each. So I wanted to try it. I never tried it before. I'm sure it's good because I love Jiffy. Two of the ZD. I didn't have this particular noodles. These are 82 cents. One of the panay. And that's because... We already went through one box, so I was replenishing that. And I didn't have any of these small shell noodles either. All of these were 82 cents in my store. Oh, baking bread. So I have a bread machine, but I want to really, really master all different types of breads. And I know I probably, it may take years to master, but you guys get the point. Um, I did have a comment and I did screenshot her comment because I, want, I had to look through it. It took me a good 15 minutes to find it today <laughs> and she told me have i ever checked out this channel and i was like no so i will put that up on the screen so if you guys want to check that out okay so i got two of these i got one of these i think last year and i waited or either it wasn't on my radar so um they are i always see some christmas stuff or some kind of decor to pick up but I'm limiting myself to only certain things. So I got this little Christmas tree. I don't know what other designs they have because I have not watched any shot with me. Um, this was $2.78. And these little things, if they they go quickly. So people will snack them, snag them up. This was $3.78 for this. They had other patterns, but I didn't like those. They may have had some more solid red. I'm not sure. But the plaid. It was some type of plaid with little lines. I didn't like that. Okay, y'all. So, I also picked up these. And I know I went through just about all of these last year. And this is the only one that I really liked. I mean, I may settle for another one. People just open it and throw it away. But um, that's 100 gift tags. But I probably may need another one. Excuse my mess. I have my attachment now to... What's it called? Vacuum seal my jars. So I finally put my llama beans. Um, I think it was the 15 bean soup and the pinto beans in the jars. And I should have picked up two more today. So I need to put this, yeah, one to fill this up and one to fill up this in my jars today. And I'm gonna vacuum seal that, put the dates on them and I should be good to go. All right, y'all, so from the Dollar Tree, that's what's that is left. I know sometimes for me, for like stuff like this, I'm doing 50 other things and I have to stop and make myself do it, if that makes sense. Like right now, I need to put my table together. It's still in a box. I finally told Trail to move it so I can get that out of the way so I can pull out my Christmas stuff on November the 1st. So I'm doing like 50 million things supposed to do other 50 million things and don't do it. So I have to say, Hope, you need to do this. It's not gonna take but five minutes. You keep procrastinating. Okay, y'all, so I got two, no, one of the crushed red pepper. I needed this and so the cilantro leaves. I never tried this before. I think this is the only spice or 
um, herb that I did not have that I know of that I can think of. I only got two of the whole milk. They had plenty of the shelf stable milk. I needed some steak sauce. My kids go through this and I only picked up two today. They did have a one, but Dollar Tree only carries the hearty, something in hearty, and it tastes like ketchup, and I don't like that. I like the original A1 sauce, so I'm going to have to get some from Dollar Tree, I mean from um, Walmart. Okay, y'all, so I got some coffee, mate. I don't drink a lot of coffee, but I want to get some Shelf Stable Creamer, and this lasts to 2022. I also got two of these little orb balls. They have them in black, white. I want to say red, but I don't remember. But I got navy because right now my accent color is blue navy. And um, even though I'm not putting this out right now, I will um, put it up for later because it will be wrong. It will be gone. I was watching someone and she mentioned these teas. I'm not really a big tea drinker either than southern sweet tea um because from the south but uh she i know tea is really great for so many different um reasons and i know i had a real bad sore throat not too long ago I, it may have been last year though and i got some tea and it worked it it was awesome so i wanted to get this chamomile tea from the dollar tree and i was watching her Hall and I wish I knew who it was, remember who it was, but I watched so many purple hauls now. And you get 20 bags in here, and chamomile helps you relax. And I think you're sleeping. And then I got some peppermint tea. And then I got some green tea. And I can't remember all the benefits, but I was like, mm, I'm writing it down. <laughs> so I probably uh, will look up the benefits. Maybe I'll put it across the screen. Okay, y'all, so I got some coffee. We are not, um, this is, says espresso. Uh-oh. Yeah, this be fine. I wanted to get this because I knew that it was a longer shelf life and we're not big coffee drinkers. I do have several K-Cups, several that I stocked up on, but I just wanted to get that because we have the little thing that goes into the um, machine. And then I got some allergy medicine. Sometimes, like on the weekend, I want to sleep a little bit longer, getting a deeper sleep. I will just take an allergy pill. Sometimes I get out the shower and I'm just like, I don't know if it's a soap or you just have an allergic reaction. Your allergies just bother you every blue moon. And I'll take one of those and I'm fine. So, plus I needed some more anyway. Then I got this first aid kit. I saw this at the register. And these are the items that come in it. So I thought that was neat. I got this liquid skin, um, the better bondage. I have been seeing this in the Dollar Tree. One time I went in there looking for it and they didn't have it. I probably should have got two of these. So I may go back and get another one. I love this elegant amber and oud. And I picked up three of those. And then I got the Welch's strawberry. I just wanted to try the strawberry. They didn't have the original. Now, so this little village, every year Dollar Tree comes out with the little villages. Um, sometimes on their website, they will offer the entire collection, maybe every year. But you have to be quick because it gets gone quick, like within a flash. So these are new. The antique shop. I think this is a church, general store. And this is... This, look, this just looks like a house. So Josiah likes this. He's over here breathing. <laughs> He's over here breathing, looking at him. And what you can do is put a little tea light down at the bottom. I'm sure Josiah busted it. Oh, no, he didn't. But anyway, you just move the sticker and put the little tea light that Dollar Tree has. Then I picked up this little truck with the little camper. And everything else we already have, I think. Then I also, also to add to like our gaming preps, y'all, I or fun activities, is this 500 Puzzle by Artbox. And I got this one, this 300 one. 
and then this other 500 one. So I picked up some in another haul. I'll see if I can find it and link it. Um, it was probably the last Dollar Tree haul that I did. And so I think I'm gonna make a box of all the puzzles and stuff and put them up because Sai is already asking, can he do it? No, he cannot do it right now because he will, he will do the puzzle. Plus these are really small for him. But he'll do the puzzle, he'll need help. And then he'll just, y'all, he'll just start tearing it up, maybe all over the place. He used to bite them. Okay, I got a lighter. Oh, and what I wanted to say too, is I was thinking for Christmas, like some activities we can do in the house, maybe get them a karaoke machine, I'm not sure. And then, um, cause I seen someone at Sam's when someone was doing a shot with me, or I think it was a shot with me. And then, um, I want to get them like more board games for Christmas. And I noticed at Walmart that they are through third party sellers and some of them are high, really high. So I need to go in the store and go over there and look myself. Okay y'all, so I got a lighter and I got two of these little backpacks. Okay, I got two of these little backpacks because my brother, um, he works at a prison and so they can't take they have to have like a clear bag and even though this is the most flimsiest probably cheap bag he may need to only take like one or two things or something in it so i figured it wouldn't hurt because if i go back they'll be gone i got him two and even if the straps break or something he can still i don't know put something in it and I can make him up like some from my stop pile, like a really nice gift basket and throw this in there. So they have to have clear stuff when they go in there. And I'm about to do my collard greens. That's why they sit in there. That's it, y'all. So thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Are you guys filling in the gaps, planning for the holidays? I would love to know. All right, y'all. Bye.